Welcome to a new modern video. This deck I have in front of me just won the modern challenge and it's something that I've never seen before in modern. It is an Eldrazi aggro combo. We're not playing the one ring. We're playing the popper combo of Baskin Broodscale plus Blade of the Blood Chief. And we're playing an Eldrazi aggro shell with mana dorks like the Lighted Halfling and Boreal Druid. And some very powerful Adrazis like Flesh Raker, Thonots here. Of course, we have Kozex Command. And we also have Urza Saga, which works as a toolbox. You can get your Blade or your Hate card like Haywar Might, Vexing Bubble, Needle Cage, blah, blah, blah. That is the deck I'm playing. We had a different list a couple of um, weeks ago. I played the Golgari version that Mad Nas won his RCQ with. Uh, NASA player that I have just uh, top aided the uh, GP Vegas with this past weekend. We took a draw in the penultimate round to lock top eight. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And uh, yeah, outside of that, this list looks like oh, yeah, steering's very good in this deck. Can pick up either half of the combo. Okay, let's go keep. I can go Forest Boreal Druid, a card that haven't seen hasn't seen a modern uh, play in a long time. And uh, yeah, let's see, let's see what happens on turn two. I don't know. I can go Rumble, or I can go Flesh Raker. It depends. So it make a spot that's strong. Yeah, I think I just kind of want to go Flesh Raker here. Things go, I have no idea what that means. That's to Exile? That's crazy. Path to Exile. Two planes. White over the Orchard Phantom. No targets. No targets. Uh, well, I was going to. I think I'll still cast this. I get Urza Saga. I don't think it's a matchup where I want to stone rain you. I'll play Rumble. You probably have another White Orchard, but I don't care too much. Okay. Root scaling end. Feel the ruin? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I got my third forest. And that flies, so I can fly over my Soul Mika spawn. Nope, it doesn't. Draw Blade of the Blood Chief. Um, I can go Steerings, find another Blade of the Blood Chief. I can win the game. Flesh Raker also wins me the game. Go Brood Scale first. Then I can go Blade of the Blood Chief. I'll equip. Okay. And then I guess I'll uh, attack. 
should have probably kept, but whatever. I'll keep a second main. Doesn't matter. Should maybe play Flesh Raker first. All right, I ran out of basics, so if they still don't rain me now, it actually works. Right, let's play Flesh Raker. And then I'll um attack and pass. Hmm. I guess I can deal a lot of damage here, maybe. Let me think if I have lethal. I can play Kozik's command. Yeah, I should have done that. No, I'll pass now, but it could have been a lot of damage. So, Kozis Command deals me, deals them 5 damage, 4 tokens, 5 plus 4, 9, I have 12 damage. It's not enough. Yeah, I'll just pass. I have a lot of damage coming up, if I want to, if I want to with a blade. Keeping stuff around. Could have been a little bit more aggressive with my K Command main. End of turn. Let's play it. Cast. Uh, I'm gonna make Tilkins and Scry. Oaken. Athox Island, alright. Don't have basics anymore. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna bottom and top the rest. Top and top. Okay, so I'll lead with Thoughtnuts here. Or. Your hand. Okay. Then I go basking brood scale. I'll uh, equip this. I guess I can adapt first. Uh, how is it again? Oh, is yes. I could have like adapted first, not that it matters. Let's do this a bunch. Yeah, I'll do it like, I don't know, a bunch of times. Like 14. Mm -hmm. Then I'll put this like here. And then I'll go to combat. Like with both. It's not lethal, so I may don't even block. All right, I do. I'll suck a bunch of these. All right, you. Sure. I'll, uh. Yeah, I guess I'll suck these. Matters. Pass. Ah, oh, thank you, Depto. I appreciate that. 
All right, so Mono White is my first opponent. Mono White Stone Reigns. I'll cut Hayward Might and Spring Leaf Drum. Bring in, I don't know, these members. They have probably Stoneforge Mystic, which I want to kill. I don't even think I care about any other card there. You know, I don't think my Urza Saga really lives to tutor any artifact, so. I'm not gonna play for that. Alright, I'll just do this. Alright, well. <laughs> Urza Saga uh, will be turned into forests. Everything else is decent. Land Pithing Needle. Alright. I guess this Bozasia will be wisely used. Are you naming Blade of the Blood Chief? You do. Yeah, I'm still gonna play it on turn one, though. Or I can just play Shifting Woodland now. Grove used to fight that shadow. <laughs> Alright, my opponent has Demolition Field. I think I'll let him, I think I'll let him use it on my saga. Then I'll play another one. And then you have to have another one. You also kind of like coming back. Alright, you do. Like now, I think I'll like to just go... Saga, play Blade. My opponent can just die if they just all they care is to kill my Saga. I believe they also have Path of Exile and Solitude, but that's what I have, so I'm gonna... I know the Mirror is a Saga would have just been Stone Rained, but. Oh wow, another Needle. What do you name? Saga, maybe? Hope you don't name Blade again. Or, oh, we can name Bastion Brood Skill, actually. Wait a sec, this way you don't stone rain me. Did you play Leonin Arbiter? Huh. Okay. Well, it's fine by me. You wanna offer the trade? Yeah, let's offer the trade. If I go like make a token and you go stone rain, that's fine. We both don't get a land. Both don't get a land, but it's all right. I think. See if you stone rain me now. You surely do. Ah, you can also go Path of Exile. You don't. Okay. All right, now I dismember. Fortunately, though, <laughs> my only artifacts are uh, the the blade. Because I set it out every other one mana artifact, thinking I would never get to the stage where I tutor. <laughs> but. I guess I did. That was assumed that I, you know, put it with a stone. Okay, do something else. Oh, you're going Path Exile. Oh. March on the Saga. Aw, oh, that's an awful play, opponent. Don't you know this stuff works? I guess they don't die, but oh, I don't care for both, though, does it? Right. Um, those steerings. Let's go to Miko Spawn. I guess I go to Miko Spawn. Eventually, I get to four mana. Play another of these. 
pump my construct. So for five. Yeah. Hello. You play Crucible of Worlds. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Thank you, thank you, more my deal. Um uh, Boo. Mm, I guess I can go saga. Make a construct. Up for six. One is at seven, and they concede. All right, all right. We learned how to how to sequence in this first game. We did some important solitary. Now we're ready for the rest of the league. Getting my second cup of coffee, as uh, you know, if you're watching this on YouTube, I this is my third league today. I woke up very early, jet lag from my return from Vegas. So, I'll definitely, won't play at my best, but, uh, you know, been away from home a lot of time, I have a lot of videos to make, so, hope you can find me entertaining still, even though I'm a little bit tired. Usually, I try to do two leagues a day to be focused, I think the first two leagues we were focused, now... What was the best part of my trip to Vegas? Making top 8 of the limited open, definitely. At the end of day 1, where I faced a deck with 2 Overlord and 2 Barber School. Then I won, was definitely the highlight. Alright, let's go! The Storm? No, it's Zoo? No, they don't have Giganta, what's that deck? I don't know, but they're going to play with Ragavan, so it's definitely a good start. If I was on the play, I could have gone turn to Soul and Mika spawn. Mm -mm. I think I'll block. Ragavan definitely a good card on the play. This could be... Boros without Gigantha? Gigantalis? I'll go Rumble turn 2, Glaring Flesh Raker, not good. Dice to removal. Even though opponent uh, likely does not have removal, or they would have played it on the Halfling, I think. Take three. Ranger, Captain of Eos. I guess that's why you didn't have Giganta. Okay. Let's see what you get. All set, lock. Mm -hmm. All right, what can we do now? Oh, um, can I do some crazy things here? Probably. By a flesh raker. Right, so let's count here. I can go flesh raker. I can top two Eldrazi Temple and play flesh raker. Now, then, I can. Now I have one floating for or, for Eldrazi's. Can suck the spawn and this. Play new flesh raker, make two tokens, play blade of the blood chief, make two tokens, pass. Alternatively, I don't think I have that many other good choices, so I'll do that. 
not saying that this is a bad choice. I'm just, I was just thinking. So, I'm gonna go Flesh Rake. Eat. Flesh Raker. This card is very good in Legacy. Aspetta. Is there a world where I go Blood Sheep first? No, there is not. Maybe actually there is. I go Blood Chief, uh, make a token. No, no, no. I'll do it later. So go Flesh Raker, make a token. Then I go Blood Chief, make two tokens. Then I'm gonna equip the blade. And then pass the turn. You need her, yeah, I just pass the turn makes more sense. I think I could have done better than this. All right. What you do there. You have also the Pride plus three mystery cards in hand. You discharge this. Yeah. You can see the deck list for this deck. Uh, you click exclamation mark deck. Open that link, which is the link, and then you click on Eldrazi Agro Modern. From this link, you can also shop on TCG Player. It has the affiliate code that supports the stream. All right, when I got rid of both of my Flesh Rakers, Drop. Oh, wow. Hey, sacrifice that. Wow. Okay. That's terrible. That's a terrible play. It is what it is. Go Saga. Make a spawn, blow up your sacred foundry. What do I want to get here? Saga? Is there another land I want to get? I want to get just in Woodland? No. I think I just like Saga. Saga's great. Can I, can I beat a Flage with Saga? Probably can't. But what can I do? I don't think I can do much. I'm just gonna get Saga. Now, I can either equip. I'll also go Ewer Might and equip. No, 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 I don't wanna go Ewer Might. I'll equip and pass. Now, this doesn't die to three damage because I can just suck the spawn and make it a four four. Well, there may be we're afraid of the One Ring, which we don't play in our deck. 
They have also the Pride in end. They also have Amped Raptor. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Now you have no energy, but you go to one. You go to three. You can attack with a flyer. Blah, blah, blah. Let's see what you flip with a Raptor. Oh, you flip. The one ring. Perfect. Perfect. So you have one card in its pride. You have three energy, which will let you do the Guide of Souls thing. Not dead next turn. I'd love to draw a Baskin Brood skill. That'd be nice. Oh. So like a spot. Let me stone rain one more mana. I should make constructs. What should I do? Actually, there's not that many lands I want to get, right? What's my plan here? Because I'm eventually dying to that cut warrior. I can't even attack. Like, even if I get so we make uh, the, the land that copies things from the graveyard. I think I'm actually just like dying this game. So I should just. I don't know. Top deck. I mean, can I make very large construct? I guess I can. I right, think about what should I do here? Prismatic Beast, I can put me to six, but yeah, I don't think it changes much. I just can't attack, because if you attack, you flip. I don't know, you don't have you don't have any cats to block with. You don't have any cats to block with. So I don't they don't have lethal. Alright, alright. Hello, Hamengu. Dai, let's think about this. Let's play this well. I know I can. Mm. How many construct can I make? Unfortunately, there's no land that I can get off Saga. Oh, I can tap. These ones get a land, so I'll have one. Yeah. I don't think it changes much, so might as well just just stone rain. Might as well just stone rain. But I need to top deck next turn, otherwise I die to the flyer. I think at this point, Midas has been a um, shift in Boodland. I think everything else is the same. And then I can go... Um, Renee War Might. I can play Prismatic Pista. And attack with this. Don't block, I'll sacrifice the spawn. Make a construct. So that you take four damage and I have enough blockers to survive. Oh, never mind. I'm dead on board now. They just put. Oh, wait, I was those that. Yeah. Oh, no, no, they don't have energy. What am I talking about? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wake up, Mangu. Wake up. All right. I'm in a terrible spot. I don't have Shadow Spear in my deck for some reason. A I die if I don't top deck. I don't know what I have to top deck. I guess if I top deck Baskin Brood Skill, I win because I copy Galarian Flesh Raker with the Shifting Woodland. Top deck Baskin Brood Skill? Blade of the Chief. I'm dead. I'm dead, right? Let me just think. I can gain two life with Awar Might. Does that change anything? I guess there's a world where I gain more life because I copied the Aware Might. But my opponent just blocks with a Johnny. Yeah, I guess there's a world in which I survive. Should I even make this construct? I guess I can make like one. 
It's like, yeah, I have to... I don't know, I have to, like, use a lot of green mana, because I have to, like, crack this to kill something. So I have to spend, like, six mana total. So I, I don't think I can make a construct. Because I, I have... I need to spend six mana here, right? So I need to spend six mana. I have one, two... Yeah, I just... I can't I can't make a construct. I'm just all in on combo in here. Again, if I had... Shadow Sphere, I would have won this game for sure. With it. That's not the case. Allora, abbiamo detto I need six mana. I guess I have, so I just played this and... Oh, I keep. I can't attack, because if I attack, the Johnny flips and shoots me. If they, have, if they have Flage, I'm also dead. Or Lightning Bolt. I'm being it. No, I'm not dead. I'm not dead here. Oh yeah, now I am. Because now they can give flying to two things. Alright, alright, I'm dead now. Bro. Okay. There's a lot of clicks to survive to then just stop like a land and die anyway. Mm. But what if Shadow Spear would have won this game? So that's maybe something you can think of in deck building. Let's bring in these members and uh, let's take out. Let's see yours. I think Flesh Raker has to go in this matchup. Like, it just dies to removal, it's pretty bad. I think it was just extremely bad in this game. Like, I spent so much resources to just put it into play and it just died to removal. Alright, actually, I'm gonna leave it on the play, maybe? I don't know, I don't think anything in the sideboard is better. Is it Miko, Sp Miko Spawn Wars? It's not great. Miko Spawn is not great. It's not great, I agree. Yeah, maybe maybe that's the card I need to cut. Go land offling. Pass. <sighs> Wake up. All right. Draw ancient steerings. Uh, what if I get Blade here instead of Flesh Raker? Yeah, I'm just down on Flesh Raker. I don't think it's very good. Okay, let's play Blade and pass. White Orchard Phantom? Depends on the... I guess they played this over Charmo? Not bad. Go Rumble. Let's see what I find. Brood Scale. Alright. Um, I can cast it. I think it's a mistake.
I think brazen. Where do you go? On the yeah. Yes. I'll uh, play one bird scale and pass. I play two bird scales. I think I like to make a construct here. Yeah, making yeah. One bird scale and pass. If they bolt at end of turn, I'll allow it. One less bolt for this one in end. Another oh, prime charm. That's annoying. All right, make a one one draw. Flesh raker. All right, so let's go flesh raker first. Actually, let's go flesh raker like this with a second of Drazi Temple. Flesh raker. Root scale. I'll uh, adapt immediately. And uh, attack for one. I guess now it's better to have a uh, so and Miko spawn than Flesh Raker. But I can't decide. What a draw. Opponent is minus screwed. We have a decent board state. Lots of good top decks. Static Prison, the Flesh Raker. Wow. Is that Bolt? Draw. Well, there it is. I called it. So let me go spawn. Destroyer land. What do I go get? Probably Urza Saga, I'm assuming is the best. I guess I'll sacrifice this. This one pumps, right? Oh, no, never mind. I don't know why I thought that. All right, attack for four. And just win because my opponent is minus screwed. Go to game three. Now I have to decide what we. Maybe I don't know what do I want. It doesn't seem like there's like like it seems like these seven cards are bad. But I don't think I have like that many things I want. Maybe I just Oh just one of each, not sure.
Okay, I'll uh, keep this in, that's all right. Uh, I'm gonna go Boseju. Uh, I think... So if I go Halfling, my opponent has to bolt instead of getting a Survey Land. And then I can go Steerings next turn to find a land drops. I think it's better to go Halfling now, so I forbid them to go Survey Land. I still go Survey Land, but, you know, I think it's, I think it's better like this. Mulligan to 6, so, you know, Survey Land can obviously be relevant. Maybe need a second land, stuff like that. All right. Okay. It's okay. Raptor, all right, find a removal spell, please. Throbbing Chop, perfect. Perfect, the dream. You go, you do nothing, you don't cast that, of course. Now, I need to draw it land here. Untapped. Forest. Oh, perfect. Uh, what is my player? It's gonna be Stirrings. Okay. Getting a Believe All Drazi Temple. And now I can go Forest. Halfling. See? See if they have the Flake. It's okay, no problem. No problem. I think my play next turn is gonna be Flesh Raker Blade. So I can't bring back Flage. So this is gonna be Flesh Raker Blade. Pass, got an ATB. All right, another hub. Let's hope no ring. Seems like a ring. No. Another flage. Oh, Charma. Wow. Sure. That's annoying. So Eldrazi Temple was good. Plus two on Powerful Flyer is a lot. Yeah. That's okay. Let's find Brood Skill. Let's find Brood Skill for the win. Come on. Brood Skill. No. That's okay. Um, I can get Temple. And then what? I can play Blade. Alright. Oh, I can do this. I can, I can do this. I can equip. Suck a spawn. I can equip. Suck a spawn. Play. Blade. Now what else can I do? Attack. You can block, I mean, I don't think you can block. If you block, I'll definitely blow you out. So I think you just take, and after you took, what do I do? I want to play K Command. I'll, I don't think so. No, I think I'll just equip and pass. I think that's what I'll do. I'll just equip and pass. You block? Alright. Then. I'll go colorless. And two. K Command. Exile a card in the graveyard. I want to make a token or draw. 
I think I just draw because like token I, I make it regardless. So I don't need it. Just draw. Draw and exalt lage. Yeah, so I'll make a token from the flesh raker. Scribe one and draw Thanos here. Could be worse. And then I suck this for mana, pump the flesh raker, becomes a 5-5. Five, five. Cool. They didn't block, I wouldn't have done this. Lots of cool tricks you can do. You play a Johnny with one card in hand. The attack. Ooh, this member, that's good. Let's play TKS pre combat. This member's very good here. Make a token. See what you have. I don't know what you may have, honestly. No idea. What can you have? Queen of Glory. Now, what it can do is a keep. Attack. Now opponent will be interested in chump blocking with cat. And then I'll dismember the Ajani. Maybe I should have put a blade here. Yeah, because this thing is becoming incredibly large. I could have like diversified my threats. It was better if I kept the Tonnots here. But it's okay. So the Flesh Raker is gonna become, I don't know, 12? Yeah, 12. Shifting Woodland can also copy no, nothing. I guess if they kill something. No, but I know they have uh, Arena Glory. They say GG. I guess they die. All right, we beat Boros. We lost game one, but we won game two and three. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Take a bathroom break and come back for round three. As long as they make the cards and they make a competitive system, I'll be happy. Let's go round three. Opponent reveals the bar of destiny. And starts with Utopia Sprawl. Strong. What did you exile? I think I'll go halfling. Instead of steerings. If you draw a second land, I don't think I'd rather do something else than Steerings. Okay, you can slab your end. Point of four mana turn two. I can already play the ring. I play Karn instead. Okay, Karn is slightly annoying because that makes me unable to equip. They choose the one ring from the sideboard. Okay, so I think I should go Rumble here. Actually, Steering's probably better than Rumble. Yeah, I should go Steering's for Forest. Or at least hope to. Okay. And then Rumble. For, uh... Let's see. I'll Razi Temple. Perfect. I got a nice little land refill this turn. And a little setup turn. And next turn we can go... We can go... You know, on the play with a very good star, so probably gonna lose, but to decided to make a play, it is going to be 
So we make a spawn. Oh, wow, they don't play the ring. Okay. Got Spugin's Labyrinth. Let's underrate a World Breaker. They have three cards in hand. Two cards in hand. They minus Karn. What do you do there? Trinisphere? You do Trinisphere. Okay. 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 Right. What can we do? Well, I think my play is just Taunus here, here, honestly. Yeah, yes. I mean, it's unfortunately mana inefficient. But it is what it is, and I have to take the, um, the one ring down. Take ring, or do I take card? I take Karn, you can get a ring again. I think I take ring. I don't know. I don't I don't feel good anymore about this game. Not that I felt not that I ever felt great. My opponent has four mana on the play on turn two. Usually you lose these games. Alright, they drew a land, meaning they can go new Karn plus Ring. So this tunnels here basically did nothing. Alright, but let's see what I can do now. Now I can exile this train of sphere. Alright, so can I play Flesh Raker first? I can't. Bayen, 11th month. Thank you, Bayen. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Alright, can I do Kuzak's command on Trinosphere? This is command on Trinosphere, tapping 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. A car and you block? Yeah, I think it's alright. Uh, cause this command on Trinosphere, I'm gonna uh, make X tokens and exile a creature. You wanna draw, maybe? No, cause like, I can't even equip, so I'm gonna do that. Yeah, so X tokens and exile a creature. Uh, to X is currently six. Hmm. X is currently three. So I can click the button done. Now, what can we do? I can go Flesh Raker. Like this. I can go Flesh Raker. Followed by Root Skill. Yeah. Let's go Flesh Raker. Maybe I can go Flesh Raker, followed by Boreal Droid and pass. And slow roll this Brood skill. Yeah, that's better. Flesh Raker. And then Boreal Droid. And attack card when it blocks. And we're all happy. Now they untap with Karn. With a lot of mana, which is never good. Never good. So, I've done my big turn, now it's their time to do the big turn. 
You can also replay Trinus Sphere too, if they want to. You play Miko Spawn, topping three lands. <laughs> That's powerful. Second main, top five, what's that? K command, examine flesh raker. All right. And you make three tokens. <laughs> now, now this is gonna be very hard. It's gonna be very hard. Let's play Kozilek's command, make tokens and scry, double max, I think I'll just go max. What am I looking for? What am I looking for? What's my out here? Do I have an out? I don't think I have an out. I can't equip with Karn in play. One just holds the defenses for it. I think I'm just done. I'm just done this game. Masakitaro wins. Uh, sideboard. Needle for ring. I don't like dumping sphere. Everything seems very good. Maybe just cut blade, but like kind of a combo deck that I want to win quickly. Maybe spring lift drum. Yeah, I'll take out spring lift drum. All right, that's a good end. Wanna go Yavi Maya? Mm, probably not. Wait, Mulligan's to five. Yeah, I'll just go Prismatic Vista. Stretch of Forest. And then I can go Spawn, so, so when we go Spawn in Drizzy Temple. This one, all right, it's a strong start. Yeah, I think I don't want to go Miko Spawn. Now that I drew Boreal Druid, I can slow roll and do a bigger X next turn. Yeah, I'm gonna go all in on uh, Stone Rain now. All in on Stone Rain now. So I can go next turn Stone Rain, the turn after Stone Rain. And I can get like Urza Sagas. I just list one a modern challenge. We're trying it. Wow, six different types in the graveyard. <laughs> With five cards. That's that's unusual. When I can play Ring, which obviously is strong, but you know, what can I do? They don't have much though. Yeah, I mean, probably gonna win me the game and we're gonna go game three. With the model to five and I turn three and kick her and make a spawn, that's pretty powerful. Oh, you have consigned to memory. Wow. I didn't expect that. Makes sense, huh? Don't get me wrong. I just didn't expect that. All right. You fully counter my card. 
and it's a turn. Okay, still don't have much. Okay, so I can go blade. Equip. Top six. Play this. It's not really that. Let's see if it works. It does. All right. Now, what do I copy? I'll just copy the Urza Saga. I can move the equipment around. Pass. Well, game three, I can have Nitro's Claim as a Stone Rain type of a card, as in kill your Sprawl or Talisman. And the thing is that what do I cut? Everything else. I think it's too important. I can't sideboard out anything of what I have. The, the other cards are too important to sideboard. Alright. And solid. Would Shadow Spear be good? Yeah, there was a game where Shadow Spear would have been very good against Boros. I lost game one, but then I won game two and three, so didn't get didn't get punished. What's the shutting down? Ring and card. That's what my opponent has. Alright, they go turn three. Oh, strong. Okay, command turn three. Turn two, sorry. And you draw a card. Okay. Off link again. <laughs> Old Dork. Alright, you don't have Ringo card. And you don't even have Kozak's command, I think. Um. I think I'll go Thonnots here. I can go Flesh Raker, but I mean, what can my opponent have there? Ah, no, you know what they have? They have the, the counter. So I'm going to play this. They have the counter spell. I'll play it now. Yeah. Maybe I could have held this for Flesh Raker. Not sure. You can go. Hmm. Well, the rumble puts this in the graveyard, which is always scary. And then I assume they get Karn, but I can discard it with Thonnots here. Oh, never mind, I can cast it now. But they don't. Hmm. I guess they have another consigned to memory. <laughs> Not much I can do to that. Not much I can do to that. We we'll play around it by doing something else. I can double spell Flesh Raker plus Blade, but I'm not sure what that brings me. So yeah, I'll just let you counter this. Okay, you don't have it. 
What you got? What's that? Command. You have K command. You do. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You top top. Oh no. It's bad news. Top top is bad news. Hey. Green scenarios if they go ring, but I don't think they'll be as bad to go ring now. Walking ballista for one, one so little. So flesh raker. How do I tap? I don't think I care about green, right? Like, this thing is dying anyway, so I might as well just attack with my Boreal Druids. Whatever. Go Blade. F6. Or F6. Uh, auto Yield. Auto Yield. Then I can... Just attack, I think. Um, should have maybe not played Blade, but just attack with the Boreal Druid. Yeah, that was a mistake. I made a mistake here. Should have I forgot that this thing can't be equipped. Yeah, mistake. Shouldn't have attacked with this. You can't wait to create it into SpongeBob? Yeah, hopefully SpongeBob is good. That would be fun. Right. Hmm. Yeah, I could have attacked with Boreal Druid as well. Hmm. Definitely a miss. Oh, wow. It just... Oh, no, 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 yeah. Ah. I guess that would have just... Luck would have spawned, but yeah. My bad. My bad. Uno, dos, tres, Man. Okay, they're gonna go Emmerclear. Yeah. The one attack would have made such a huge difference. Oh, you flashed back Koza's return? Alright, then it wouldn't have made a difference. It would have killed my thing anyway, even if Karna was a less loyalty. Alright, GG. GG, I was defeated. I don't think I could have done much in this match. Keep, 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 keep. Forest Halfling. Stopping ground. Alright, what's that? A cattle? Utopia Sprawl. Alright, could be at the same deck I just played against. Bruce Kill. Forest, Springly Drum, Ancient Steerings. As soon as Magical Line. <laughs> That's me. Alright. Hmm. The options are between, so we make a spawn and Saga. I think it's gonna be Saga, just because Saga gets me the Blade Chief in a while. Talisman? 
What rumble? Okay. Can get King's Labyrinth. Probably good. All right, you went for Devourer of Destiny. That's unexpected. Went for Devourer of Destiny. <laughs> oh, I can go. Tonnet's here. Followed by Alright, so if one hand is not good, I don't care about ring. What if I just take rumble? No, I think I take spawn. Yeah, I take spawn here. Cause then I can play Awarmite. She can kill the ring. I just wanna be mine efficient and tap out. I don't care if they see it coming. It's turn three. I've done a lot of things. I eight permanence, discarded you a card, I have saga to, that threatens the combo in a few turns. Talisman. Mm -hmm. Four mana. Ring. Mm -hmm. You haven't made a land drop yet. You made it. Okay. Oh, uh, let me think now. What should I do with Koza's command? That's gonna be tokens. But how many though? I think it's just full, right? Yeah, it's just full. All of it except the drums. I'm gonna do X and X. Target, target. Like this. Right, so what can go wrong here? <laughs> what can go wrong? How can I lose this game? It doesn't seem very losable. I think like these top cards are just all great. So I'm gonna go like bottom, bottom, top, top. And then I just heal a ring. Hello, Moonbreaker. How's it going? Like, there's really not that much. Like, all this just doesn't do anything. Mm, I guess Kozilex Command. Kozilex Command is annoying. Yeah, Kozilex Command would be... Bad, but that's fine. I still go make a spawn, so I don't think I can lose. Is this a recording or live? It's live. Hello, I'm, I'm a person, I'm a real person. I was just uh, thinking a lot and uh, miss your comment. You like this deck? Nice. Flesh Raker is underrated. Eh, in modern, it's just hard to make it work, but yeah, it's been very good so far. Yeah, I'm streaming for almost six hours. Yeah, woke up at 5 a.m. this morning. 
jet lag plus I need to I need to make a couple more videos because I'm gonna be leaving soon again the daily content you gotta be you gotta be recording a lot of videos for the daily content but we're doing it we're doing it So meter. Opponent uh, can play the, the VAR, but this doesn't do anything against me. It kills this halfling, which I don't care about. Oh, you're doing this. Oh, well, that's not bad. I'm just gonna have six and see what happens. Like, I mean, it could have killed my brute skill, I guess. I'm not sure what they're looking for. Maybe the Kozuk's return. What are you talking about? No cards in it. You scribe both all four to the bottom. Nice. Do you draw something powerful? No. Okay. The blade. Let's play this ancient steerings. Looking for a rude, uh, sorry, flesh raker. I don't find it, but I guess Kozilex command will eventually find it. All right, who's ready for some clicks? Oh wow, opponent doesn't do it. So in paper here, the way you win is you uh, get infinite mana, get infinite counters, play Kozilek's command for infinite, get Flesh Raker casted, and then you deal infinite damage. Yeah, opponent was not ready for the clicks. Th th thankfully, you know I'm not gonna be unhappy if my opponent. Uh... So I think the sideboard is just this. Not because my rest of the cyber is bad, but because the rest of the main deck is good. Anxab, do you own the One Ring? Because if so, Boros uh, doesn't have problems against um, Pyroclasm. I think if you have four rings, Force is fine. You don't overextend. I mean, earlier I played a, I played a Boris League and I only lost to the worst matchup. Went 4 1, losing to the only Boris bad matchup. A. Okay. Do I play Might? Yeah, I'll go Forest Might. Forest might go. Fortunately, there's no land. I guess there is, but. Oh, wow, land untapped? What you got? Bolt? Anoli Heat? Where does that come from? Aren't you playing Timur Ramp? <laughs> Alright. I mean, it's better on the Heat, on the Might, than on the Root Scale, I guess. Okay, you have two cards in end only though. And I have an answer to ring. I think I go saga rumble. What do I get? I think I get the Mika Spawn. I think I'll let you go Needle. Am I queued for Prague? Yes. In two ways. One, by winning my 80 people RCU. And two, by qualifying to the Pro Tour Chicago. The Stone Brain. 
All right. Combo is off the books. We're going to win beatdown. Always a pleasure to be Stonebrain. Always a pleasure to play combo against people with stone brains in their side. It's really the privilege of playing combo is that people side stone brain against you. All right, now, what's my play? Nothing really, just, just, just land go. Lost in the top eight of the GP Vegas. A construct. Did I not? I thought. It, oh yeah, yeah. I don't have any artifacts in my deck. Huh, that's funny. I'm gonna make an artifact or stone rain. You, I think a stone rain is better. Yeah. I don't have any artifacts in my deck because I drew the two of them and my opponent stone rained the other ones. That's no problem. Uno, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go stone rain. They don't even have blue mana up, so they just received the stone rain. I shouldn't have six. I think I'll pick the needle for ring. I think it's better that way. Does Italy have winter? Yes. So Italy is very, I mean, it's very big. So the north is very cold. The south is quite hot. I live in the center. I would say it's cold. But like not now, let's say in, I guess, about to be cold. Oh, I'm gonna get Urza Saga. It's not like Canadian cold, but I guess the north is Canadian, like you have snow and things like that. Maybe it's like not, it doesn't get incredibly low numbers, still decent numbers. Anyway, let's name the one ring. You thought I lived in Genova. Wow, how did you think that? It's actually one of the few places in Italy I've never been to. <laughs> That's funny. All right, putting draws Eldrazi Temple. The steerings. You're very colored mana at the moment. Yeah, getting the saga was probably a mistake. It's probably a mistake. But what can I do? I don't think I could have done much else. Right. So tap it both. Make a construct. Yeah, this saga. It was, it was not good. Oh. Not great. I give them a free life. Hopefully, it doesn't matter. But I shouldn't have tapped the forest. They can play the Emrakul now. It's coming. Emrakul is coming. Alright, Flesh Raker. 
It's not bad. All the sagas brick. Prismatic Vista fetches for nothing. Polybius. Welcome for the 18th month. You're about to bazajuing a land. Actually, it gives you color. Everything's from Alaska. Nice. Point of surveils with the land that I bazaju. Then a chump attack. Was this command would be lovely. Yeah, it would be lovely. I think we're a construct. Okay. Oh my, he left the card on top. That's scary. Okay, it's my turn to play now. It's my turn to play my turn. <laughs> Draw. Breaker. It's not bad. Flesh Raker. And let's play a land. And I guess I can just adapt this sorcery speed. Daily one damage. And pass. No reason to attack. You left the card on top, so that's scary. My I can't I can't combo. The blade of the blood chief was exiled by a stone brain. So, so out it's there. Eight mana. What's this? Cake mend? Attack me first. Do you have another emerald? Oh, is that what it is? No. That was what's that? Breaker. Okay. What do you what did you target? I'm not sure what just happened. Ah, oh, you target my construct. Okay. Well, I don't think I have outs now. Yeah, GG. Is this game two or game three? Game two. All right. Let's go to game three. No, 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 no. The K command uh, is not anymore close to the X command. That was before rotation. Now it's close to the X command. That's fine. Nothing fantastic. Not gonna mulligan. Forest. Half link. Love to draw tons here. I can go Saga, Rumble. I'll get the Skimber Scale and a Tafel. Will rumble. That means you have a turn two play already. What's that? Talisman, maybe? 
Okay. Labyrinth and Let it rumble, okay. Alright, returning the graveyard, it's scary. Very scary. Enduring vitality in Yogmoth. Oh, that's interesting. Didn't think about that. Oh, that's a cool card, Enduring vitality. Definitely seeing a lot of play right now, even in standard. Oh wow, K command. Did you K command my token? I drew. So let me go spawn. Which I'm gonna definitely wait one more turn. Uh, let's make a construct. Let's make a construct. I could have played a brute skill, play a lethal next turn, but like I think opponent's gonna play a ring anyway. Position their land so no ring. I don't think I care about that. Should I care about that? I don't like to position this land. If they play a ring, I can like kill their ring and kill their land. I don't know, I hate to position lands. I think it's bad. I think it's just a losing play, just do a card disadvantage. And also you lose time. Okay, we can ring, needle, or a wire might. Okay. Uh, let's float mana, because this turn I'm gonna do the... Alright, I think I actually get the blade here. Then I think I play a new saga. Mm -hmm. Then I play uh, Mika Spawn Kit. I'll kill your Utopia Sprawl. Because with King's Labyrinth, you can just tap it to gain back the Emrakul. What land do I get? What land do I get? So is the problem. Saga? <laughs> is always the answer? I think so. Yep, and attack. Maybe I could have gotten the ring there. Sorry, pit the needle for the ring there, since the blade doesn't do much. I'm gonna place the ring now, I don't have an answer. I'm also playing Eldrazi here in Wrath My Board. But I guess I rebuild by going Brute Skill Equip. And uh, also adapt and make it very large. Let's see what you're up to now. Okay, rumble first. Okay, you find Stone Brain, so I'm not gonna be able to combo. Which is unfortunate. That's how I wanted to win this game. <sighs> okay. K 
Can my construct be bigger than five next turn? I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh wow, you got two against Labyrinth, okay. Um, what do I do now? What do I do now? I think I want to destroy this land now. I think I'm like ahead enough that I should. Especially since you tutored Ugin's Labyrinth with a rumble, makes me a little bit further that. Alright, so let's do this. I'll play Vista Attack. I don't want to make a construct because you have Kozyaks returning the graveyard, so I'm gonna wait about that. I think I actually want to possess you now. Or maybe upkeep. If I possess you now, I give you Kozak's return Kozak command for one more. I think it's okay. That means I don't give you the I don't give you the Emerald in the end. All right. Uh, pass. Pass. So you untap now with. Okay, now what's this? I don't heat to there. Okay. Maybe I could have just passed and made double construct. But I was just, I don't know. Also, like the Emrakul under there is a little bit scary. The opponent could have just stopped and play it. Alright, so the Gogin's Labyrinth, they don't put anything under it. They have 4 plus 3, 7. So they can play Emrakul if they have a second one in end. Actually, the second one in end is super, super devastating because it blows up both of my saga without searching for anything. Close game. This is going to be the last one because. The league took a long time and right. The one ring, sure, that's not a problem. I have two answers waiting for it. I think I lost the previous match because my opponent had blue and that card. Two very annoying card cards. Right, so I make a token. Patch the deck thin. Hope to draw, I don't know, something good. All right, that qualifies. Um, okay, let me think if I can make a construct. I'll top this three. Top this three. I get a the needle, then I'll have one, two, three, four, five. So that's not enough. I guess I can't make a construct if I want to play someone make a spawn. But I kind of want to make a construct. Yeah, I think I'll have to make just construct, construct. Even if you need to finale. I have open mana. It showed me an only hit. So I don't think. Plus, I, they have ring. So I think I just make constructs here. So I make construct that go above Kozak's return. So I'm going to make them bigger than. Bigger than five. So I'll go needle. On the one ring. Now I make another construct. So that the Kuzak's return does not kill my constructs. That, that, that's my plan here.
Splunk does not work anymore now. As they are five vibes. <sighs> yeah, this does not work anymore. Gonna get Ewermite or Blade? I think I'll get Blade. I'll just equip. So yeah, if you kill my stuff, I don't know. And pass. Now, if you go any old Drazzy, you'll wrath my board. But I'll rebuild with Brood Skill combo. Alright, let's see. Very long game. It pass. All right. Okay, what do we do now? Don't think I believe, all right? Guess maybe I do. Maybe I do. I just kind of really don't want to play brood skill. I uh, sure don't want to play brood skill. I think I'm gonna go. Uh, whatever. Yavi Maya. So we make a spawn kicked. Blow up. I don't know this. Get the fourth saga. Mm hmm. You suck the spawn. All right, so that's seven. You play a Nully Heat, where? Here, uh, okay. I'm glad I never went for the combo, but I always had a Nully Heat up. Then you go K Command for three. Choosing Scry and Tokens, all right. You left one on top. Hmm. Obviously, that's very scary. Gonna search for. Uh, I wish I had Bazooka Bog in my deck. Unfortunately, I don't have it. Just gonna search for another Saga. I don't think Mikos in Gardens does anything to me. I guess he was pumping the constructs, but yeah, I don't think it matters much. And I'll uh, put the blade on one of each. So they're gonna be both lethal soon, and both of them will be around Kozlek's return at range, because the opponent has to block, so the constructs will be big. Go block at least with one, so my construct will be a six. My constructs will be six six. Yeah, just block both. All right, they're seven seven. You take one, you go to six. You have enough mana to play Emrakul, but even with Emrakul, I think you still lose. You know, oh, yeah, you still lose even with Emrakul, I think. Okay, I think so. Because, like, you kill one of my constructs.
I guess you don't lose, no. No, you don't lose. To kill the other two blocker. I needed an extra an extra attacker. I needed an extra attacker. Hmm. All right, as they take my turn, I'll uh bathroom break. I'll be right back. The opponent's laying here. Okay, so my opponent did some stuff. I don't know why they played so with Mika Spawn though. We win now. I can go Brood Scale. I can uh, put a blade on it. I can uh, play, I, I guess, Adapt. Yeah, Adapt. A token. Always yes. Then I can put the blade here. Make it lethal. And then they die. All right, I'm gonna wrap it up now. We had um, a very long league. Uh, definitely showed the power of the deck. Lost a close one to um, a Drazi ramp, but then we were able to get a revenge in round four. A, I think this deck is nice. I would maybe try to fit one Shadow Spear. Maybe the Tunnel Seer is not needed, not sure. But it was definitely a nice league. This deck does not play ring. It plays a lot of powder powerful cards. So yeah, this was um, a good league. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you haven't watching on, uh, if you're watching YouTube, haven't subscribed. Make sure to do that. I'll see you next time.